winter, things are going slow. It's probably 30 degrees Fahrenheit. Over here, so we're just getting two different types of fittings. So I purchased this uh, coupling here, or uh, yeah, coupler. on here there we go that looks good now I put in my uh, threaded copper to PEX here and uh, we're good to go for that now I couldn't remember what size this was I think it's two inch yeah two inch anyways I need to go to uh, um, Home Depot for this because I can't get nothing locally so that's going to be a trip to uh, Halifax. So anyhow, so uh, I'm going to take this with me so I don't forget. Yeah, it's kind of hard to deal with some of this stuff. It's so cold, so I uh, won't be doing much, I guess. Uh, let's see. Last time I was here, I painted. This. Oh, this looks alright, I guess. Yeah, the paint's all dry. Yeah, all duct taped in and paint dry. It looks pretty good actually for what it was. So that will work. Mm, that's gonna work just fine. Uh, I'm gonna get this bag down here. Well, there's extra place. That must be some water coming through. Made some bad weather. And we're expecting a big snowstorm today. So I might have to go to work. Open. So, yeah, so this is going to go something like that. So that's a 30 gallon bag bladder. Uh, I'm hoping to get 20 useful gallons out of it, which is still better than nothing. I think that would work, be fine. So I'm going to drill a hole down here somewhere. Wherever I figure, I'm going to drill a hole. Drill a hole uh, through the bulkhead, and then it'll come out here. And it will tee into the, uh, the tank. I still don't know what I'm going to do from there. Stuff when it's freezing. It's just too hard to work with. Um, I'm just going to start ripping and tearing this, this thing out. So. Well. Another day at the boat. Uh. Weather finally, we had a little break in the weather, I guess. A little warm spell. Not warm, but warm in northern Canada terms. It's about eh, 10, 12 degrees here today, Celsius. So I'm thinking that's probably in the 40s or something. 40s, yeah, between 40 and 50 degrees uh, for you Americans. Um, so it's not too bad, it's just doable. I don't mind working in this weather. So I think I'm gonna rip out the washroom. That's my next step there to figure out, uh, carry on with the plumbing. Um, got some tools, got this strainer. This is the last piece that uh, I was waiting for. And um, yeah, come from Amazon. I don't know, 25 bucks, 21 bucks or whatever. So I just wanted a strainer. And uh, yeah, I got all the components, so now I just got to keep ripping out till I get to the end of the old stuff and start rebuilding. So, anyways, uh, don't expect to get much done today. Well, I expect to get it ripped out, but um, yeah, tomorrow it's gonna be, you know, get colder again and off we go for winter. That's just the way it is here on the East Coast. We got the macerator pump.
So I'm gonna rip all this out, build in my own washroom, build in everything right here where this is. This is where the hot water tank's gonna go. Cause, Hot water is more important than than uh, storing our poop. This tank is coming. Smell bad, but I'm not sure what it is. It's a holding tank for something. Keep those through holes or not? Through holes. Uh, we're putting composting, so everything we're gonna collect, and then we're just gonna dump it when it gets full. We're actually doing that in our house right now, just for us, not for guests. Just testing it. This is the first time we've ever we've ever tried it, so we read a lot about it, and uh, I actually like the idea. Or something down there. Just one, just one. Oh, that's that yeah, works good. I like that idea. That's awesome. Okay, out the door it goes. <laughs> Maybe somebody interested in buying that. Okay. Now, let's see. My hand is wet. I don't like that, but uh, I know it's only uh, uh, the um, antifreeze. So I guess it takes stuff this size and chews it up and spits it out there. Hmm, 20 amp, big draw. This is going to be good to get rid of for our, um, our um, solar system or our, uh, our electrical system, right? Now. Bent and it's plugged up anyways. Hmm. No good. All right. We're not gonna be needing that anymore either. Now. Okay. Let's get this sink up out of here. Get this outlet out of here. This is all rotten. Look at this. Hard to get at this stuff. Bastard. Huh. 
You know what? They're actually solid. They're heavy. They're actually not uh, USA. What does it say? Made in USA, yeah. Don't know what brand they are. They're a little bit... Uh, hmm. You know what? We might rebuild those. You never know. I don't know, though. Yeah. I don't know. Probably not. We got another plan. Probably not. Hmm. Not bad. You might end up using this again. It's a pretty good uh, little sink. Just needs to be cleaned up. We'll see. Now, this would be original. For sure. stuff out of here. Yeah, all the main stuff is out. So, so, I'm not sure now what we'll do. I don't know if uh, this tub is screwed in. Part of it was cut out, original and made way for the stuff I just took out. So I might be able to take this right out, the whole thing. I don't know if I want to, and then, um, I think I'm gonna get rid of these through holes. I don't need them anymore. I won't be putting any uh, stuff out in the ocean from there, that's for sure. And then, got to, uh, Grind this off, fill that in. It looks like that will just, yeah. So you can see there was modifications made to this for sure. So we're gonna modify it again. Yeah, and I uh, just haven't decided yet. I'll probably, um, those inlets for water, that's for bringing water in and sucking sewer out. We don't need those, so I'll fill that in. And, um, yeah. Get those through holes out, mm -hmm. but uh, yeah. So here's the old, old plate from before. Well, thanks for following along so far. If you have, if you haven't, I suggest you go back and start at episode one and uh, follow along our story. Um, hopefully, I, I try to make it as exciting as I can with what with what's been going on with this um, project. Just some of the stuff, just a bit of a teaser here of what's uh, what I've been working on, and uh, the episode you're watching now will be the last bit of work I done in 2021, and then we'll jump right into uh, 2022 summer. It gets pretty heavy into uh, major repairs. <laughs>